In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to copy content into a new course. So each semester, as you request your new courses in Talon, you will need to copy content over from a previous semester. Or perhaps you are working with a lead instructor who has a course ready for you to copy content into your own shell. The process is the same for both of these. So you're first going to find your course that is empty, your brand new course that you just requested. You're going to copy the content into the course that currently has no content. So I'm going to find the course. The course here I have is called Empty Course to Copy. And I'm going to click on it. And again, I'm going to ensure that this is my blank course. There is currently no content in this course. If there's already content in here, if you copy content in, you will get duplicates. I'm going to go to Course Admin. I'm going to go to Import, Export, Copy Components. And by default, copy components from another course or org unit is already selected. So I'm going to click where it says search for offering. And I have two options here. I can search for a course name or I can just click the magnifying glass icon and it'll show a list of all my courses. Now if I have a lot of courses in here, it's probably better just to do a search for a particular keyword. I'm going to find the course that I want to copy and I'm going to select the button next to it and click Add Selected. And then I'm going to come down to where it says Copy All Components. Note there is an option here to select components. That is an option if you have specific content you need to copy into a course. Um, but I would only recommend using that if you just have a small amount of content you need to copy over. Otherwise, it makes more sense just to copy all components and then just delete what you're not looking for. So go ahead and click Copy All Components. And then you'll have to wait a few minutes for it to get done. When it's done, you'll see a green check mark. And then you can go back to Course Content and view the content there.